I believe we all have experienced different type of glitches in our reels, right? I'm not the only one. So here today, I want to share with you three of the top glitches that have been happening in different accounts and have been happening on my accounts. And I want to share them with you and how you can work around them so you can edit smoother and you can have feeling that you want to keep creating content. Okay. So let's go with the first glitch that I've seen. The one is that you record your reel on the Instagram app and you edit it there and you want to save it to your iPhone. So it's safe there, not in drafts. As I have mentioned before, if you save it in draft it's not wrong, but sometimes they can get erased. So as a prevention, always save it in your iPhone. Okay. So what has been happening is that I finish editing, recording everything that I have to do, and I want to save it to my iPhone, but it says audio not available for this reel. And it's not a track that I imported. It's not a track that I chose from the Instagram list. It's my own voice. And it says audio not available. So I got, okay. I tried to save it twice and it said the same thing. So what I did was I went to the reel that I would record it in the Instagram app and I screen recorded the reel, including with the audio, right? I downloaded that. Now I have two, the one with no audio and the one with audio. Okay. Like I'm showing you right over here. So what do I do? I go and to in any app that I like, I use Adobe Rush. I believe it's the best, but you can use CapCut, whichever you prefer. So I go to that app and I put together the one with no audio because it's the original one, the one I created, the one that the quality is still there. Okay. And then I have the one that I screen recorded with the audio included. So what do I do? I just put them together. I eliminate the image from the one that I screen recorded. So I just leave the audio and then I export it and I have the original one with the original audio and right there. It sounds long. I get it. And it sounds like, why do I need to do this if why Instagram doesn't work? But you know, you cannot control these tools. Another way is just to use a camera or to use your own iPhone. So you have two choices. Okay. Then we go to the second glitch that I noticed that has been happening lately. The one that I mentioned in a video, how to use real samples to edit faster. Right here is a video. I don't know if you remember right here it is. So you can watch it. So yes, templates is an amazing feature because you can reuse them and reuse them and you don't, and you can edit faster. But in some cases I have seen that this templates are getting too glitchy or not working or they erase your content and it's frustrating. I understand. That's why these glitches, nobody enjoys them. So what do I recommend for you before you record your video? Think, how do you want the video to play out? How the beginning you want it? How is the middle? How is the end? And you create a template in your mind. So then you record it in your iPhone or in your camera or in the Reels app, however you choose. And you already are organized on how it's going to start, how it's going to be the middle and how it's going to be the end is a mental template. I know that if the feature is there, why is it not working? I understand, but it's an alternative for you. Okay. And you can always use it again and again. Just remember to have a system of how you want them to start the middle and how to end. Now let's go to the third glitch that I have noticed is the one that you try to upload the reel that you recorded, edited, approved by you, but then when you try to put it up in the, in the, in the Instagram, it doesn't work. It's not uploading. It's not working. And you're like, okay, what's happening? And I've noticed this has happened to me. So an idea that I gave you is wait it out. If after 20 minutes, it's not going up, try to upload it again. And one thing, it won't be deleted. It will still be in drafts because Instagram believes it still hasn't been uploaded. So it's still there. So, and then you upload it and it may happen. But if it doesn't, it can be for many reasons, but I have tried this before. What I do is usually if I see that one reel, the, the first reel, that opportunity that I want to upload it, it's taking too long. I do it again and it will eventually upload. This is another glitch that I've noticed, but this is the solution. Upload it twice. If you notice that this is happening after 20, 30 minutes, because that is a lot to wait if you have good Wi-Fi connection. Okay. Then the final and bonus one that I have noticed a lot is has to do with drafts of Instagram. So you record your reel. Everything is great. You have proof that you love it and you want to save it because you wanted to upload it on Tuesday, let's say, or on Wednesday, but then you click on the draft and it doesn't work. It says the cover image or something like that. I, I can show it to you here in the image. It doesn't work. So what do I recommend is honestly, all you got to do is save it to your iPhone. Save it there, save it to Dropbox, wherever you prefer to save your content, 
do it because if you count only on Instagram app to save your content, it may not be happening. I know it's frustrating, but this is the best way to work around these glitches so you can still enjoy creating content. So I hope this helps you today. Wishing you all the best. Thank you so much. If you have any more glitches you have been experiencing, let me know right here below so I can help you.